So we build uh, pharmacy software that people use to fill prescriptions at some of your regular chains. So we have somewhere around eight to, to 9,000 pharmacies that are using our software. Um, we had figured out how to pull all that data that's in the pharmacy systems back to a central location. And when we worked on trying to get it into a database where we could hook up a reporting solution to that and be able to do um, large scale reporting several years, looking at trends year over year, things like that. Uh, we couldn't get the solutions we had in house to scale. We were using Oracle. We got up to about five of the 69 chains. And then after that point, we really couldn't manage the data and get the performance we needed. So uh, after working on that for about two years, we decided to go out and find a scalable solution, something that we wouldn't have to buy a ton of infrastructure cost. Before we implemented Snowflake and we were using an Oracle solution, we actually consumed two full, full-time DBAs uh, to support our teams. And so after we implemented the solution, we have actually scaled back to just one DBA and they actually appreciate it because they're getting to do a lot of other things besides working issues and problems and scalability. Uh, before in the Oracle solution, we we're dealing with uh, challenges of getting partition manager to run successfully in a day. And so they're constantly working issues and fires. And now it's pretty hands off for them. And they just work to make sure that they have the data. In Oracle, just to load five chains worth of data, initial load of two years worth of data would take a week to load that on the Oracle platform that we had. Um, during the proof of concept, we did that in 50 minutes in Snowflake. And right now being an Oracle shop, we have some systems that are still on um, Oracle 10. We have some that are on 12C. We have thing, you know, all this version stuff. And when things are happening in, in some of our other in-house solutions, we have to worry about, oh, they fixed that in this version. You know, I, I don't deal with that anymore with Snowflake from the standpoint of we're always on the current implementation of, of the Snowflake solution. Because I've run into that in my past where more than one time you want to implement something that needs a feature for a version you're not on, right? And then you got to go through the whole upgrade cycle and worry about can we, how long is it going to take us to get there just so we can implement and utilize that new feature. So I think that's really been a huge benefit to us on this platform and really taking the overhead of that piece away.